Well, hello, my beautiful creators. Welcome back to Mel X Create. Uh, before we begin, I want to actually give a couple of shout outs to my new subscribers. Thank you so much for subscribing. I'm going to be uh, either putting corner or anywhere on the screen uh, just to show um, appreciation to my new subscribers. I want to first shout out to David Mario. Thank you so much for subscribing, man. You're awesome. I uh, also want to give a shout out to Reckon Warrior 30. Thank you so much, man. You're awesome. Uh, Venture Quest. Thank you so much for subscribing. Really appreciate it. David Langer Lon David Lon Igero. David Longero. I hope I'm pronouncing your uh, last name right. Uh, but anyway, thank you so much, man. Uh, last but not least, Marquand Lewis. Marquand Lewis. I hope I'm pronouncing your name right as well. Um, but yeah, I appreciate for you subscribing. So thank you so much, subscribers. Um, Melex would not be here if it wasn't for you, uh, for you viewers and subscribers. So uh, yeah, if you guys like this video, uh, definitely subscribe and hit the bell for notifications to always be notified of my upcoming videos because there is going to be a lot more content coming. Um, but yeah, I also want to give a shout out uh, to Bentley House Miniatures. Uh, she is a YouTuber. Uh, she's a miniaturist. She makes a lot of miniatures and she was basically the one that inspired me and gave me this idea of doing this video. Um, hers was actually a miniature grab bag. But uh, I'm not doing a grab bag. I am doing a, basically, I know what's in my bag. Um, the only mystery is, you guys don't know what's in my bag. So yeah, um, I'm gonna do like a miniature mystery bag. So, woo. <laughs> I hope you guys are excited to see what I have to share with you guys. Uh, it's gonna be very exciting. These are things that I actually bought from Hobby Lobby. Um, I don't know if you guys know Hobby Lobby, but it's a store where it's not only for arts and crafts, but also like for people that um, have hobbies, like uh, building air airplane models, um, things with cars, um, doing clock. I don't know if anyone has like a hobby of building clocks, but they have that there too. Uh, they just have really cool, interesting things. And also they have miniature stuff there as well. So that's actually why I went to Hobby Lobby. It was mainly for my miniatures. And um, yeah, so definitely guys, if you haven't been to Hobby Lobby, definitely check that store out. They're really, really cool. I'm sure you guys can just Google Hobby Lobby and find the nearest store near you. Anyway, onward to the video. Anyway, onto what we are mainly here for. Dun dun dun, the miniature mystery bag. I do is pull out the little objects here and uh, yeah, basically talk to you guys about what I've purchased and what I'm gonna be putting into my miniature house. I've actually um, purchased like one or two little things already for my miniature house, but everything else is mainly handmade. I really want to keep it that way, um, only because I feel like it's more personal and it's definitely more rewarding when everything is handmade and made from myself rather than me purchasing things. But once in a while, it doesn't hurt to uh, just have already something made. So anyway, I'm going to pull out the first item. Chips here, um, the, their wooden lock chips. I thought that these would be like really cool. Um, you could either like have like a painting on here or you could even like polish it and um, make like a table out of it. This is actually like mainly why I bought it was because I want to make like a little miniature table out of it. I mean I'm sure there's other like props or something that you can make with these but um, that's really what I thought of when I saw these so um, I'm actually gonna make a little miniature table out of that so yeah that's gonna be put in actually my library slash living room so yeah I think it'll be like a really cool um, add-on then dun, 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 the next one is 
the uh, these little teapots from uh, fairy tale uh, fairy tale actually had a lot of cool things these are this is actually like for jewelry but um, I just thought why not just clip off these little things here and just have these little teapots to my um, like miniature um, living room slash library I thought it'd be like a little cute idea to have like tea while she's like reading her book in her library so this item that I'm grabbing from my miniature mystery bag is here. Ooh, um, this is also from Fairy Tale. I was actually like um, obsessed with like the little items that uh, this company had. This is like a little bird cage. Um, I'm thinking since I'm having a witchcraft miniature room. Those of you who love witchcraft and are into the whole like religion or just like it just for fun, I'm actually gonna be making a miniature witchcraft room. Cause like, that's like one of my interests. And I thought, why not have a little witchy room? I th thought it'd be cute. So I'm either gonna have like an owl familiar. I don't know if you guys seen um, Harry Potter, but um, if you notice, he had an owl in like a birdcage. So I'm either gonna put an owl in there or I may have a crow as my familiar and put him in here. I don't know, we'll see. Let's see, the next item. Ah, miniature little pins. I got these little pins because um, I'm actually gonna be making some little miniature pins. Because I make enamel pins. I don't know if you guys have you guys seen have actually seen my enamel pins. But if you haven't, please check out my Etsy shop. I'm going to be uh, placing an image of my shop somewhere in this general area over here. So yeah, just uh, check out my Alex Create shop on Etsy. So yeah, that's that. And... And for my next item. Um, ooh, I'm gonna be actually making a boa out of um, these little like feathery little things. Um, this is from the Flying Trapeze brand. Um, but yeah, anyway, yeah, I'm gonna be actually like cutting this out and then like making a little like little boa and putting it over her room divider. Um, I thought it would be like a little nice add on to it. She's gonna be like quite the little diva. So um, uh, yeah, her room is like kind of like diva-ish. So yeah, if you guys haven't seen the miniature bedroom that I made, the image is gonna be right here on the right hand corner. Um, but yeah, if you guys haven't seen the video, I actually made a video on the uh, miniature bedroom. So definitely check it out. It's just me decorating it. And But yeah, definitely check out that video. And let's see what else I got here. Oh, I actually got a little like tray that I'm going to put like the little teapots on. Too. I think that would be like a little cute little thing. I um, thought it was really nice and silverware to add to put the teapots onto. So yeah, I'm gonna do that. And last but not least, it, I actually got a globe. I'm gonna be putting it onto the um, in the miniature library slash living room. And I thought it would be like a little cute little add-on and the little binoculars that came with it. So yeah um but yeah these are all the items that i purchased at uh, hobby lobby it was a lot of fun um definitely like walking around and seeing all the cool neat things that they have so i'm not sponsored or anything like that so don't think that i'm getting paid for this for mentioning them but um yeah definitely check them out and I hope you guys enjoyed all the little items that I've bought and purchased. And I hope that you guys are going to be staying with me throughout this whole project and seeing what I do with it. But yeah, I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. Give it a comment down below. Give it a thumbs up. Uh, also, don't forget to subscribe. I'm going to be shouting out to my subscribers and hit that bell for notifications to always be notified. 
Um, also, don't forget that when I shout you out, I'm going to be displaying your uh, YouTube channel or name up on the right hand corner or anywhere in this general area. So, yeah, don't forget to subscribe. Uh, and uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Till next time, guys. Bye.